ask for the mandate that expires on the 12.01 a.m. on the 8th of September. Uh, we are prepared and I will ask the health department to extend that for 30 days, uh, which will push us out to uh, October the 8th. The mask mandate's been in effect since July 10th, and it's been in place almost two months. But now, as you just heard, Mayor Coventer has now extended the mandate. Good evening. I'm Josh Rowe. And I'm Latricia Thomas. Today, the mayor brought together a group of local medical and business leaders to voice their support for extending the mandate. And while it has sparked some controversy and criticism from the beginning, Stephanie Lachance joins us now live with the story of how one COVID survivor says she learned that lesson the hard way. Stephanie. Good evening, Latricia and Josh. Today, doctors and business leaders in the community gathered to extend their support for this extended mask mandate. One COVID-19 survivor I spoke to says everybody needs to do their part and wear the mask. Karen Oliver and her husband are COVID-19 survivors. She thinks she got COVID from not wearing a mask out in public just once. I think COVID is here to stay and everyone just needs to do the best that they can do to help one another. One by one, local doctors pledge their support for extending Hamilton County's mask mandate. The mask is simply a tool. Keep everything moving and keep the public safe. Work out how we can go about our lives as much as possible safely. Before the mayor they've been advising made it official. I will ask the health department to extend that for 30 days. It's not going away anytime soon. Dr. Mark Anderson is an infectious disease specialist at CHI Memorial Hospital. He knows wearing a mask isn't always popular. We have to still continue to try to prevent spread but not shut down our society. That unpopularity apparent on social media. I guess if they say I have to wear a mask, I'll take my money elsewhere, one view writes. Typical government control, says another. But Karen Oliver has a message about the lesson she learned the hard way. They need to take a good look around and ask people that have been through COVID, that are survivors from COVID, and be more conscientious about wearing the mask. Something that in Hamilton County is on the books for at least another 30 days. Coming up at six, how the business community had some input with this mask mandate. Reporting live in Hamilton County, I'm Stephanie Lachance, News Channel 9. Thank you, Stephanie. Hamilton County School Superintendent said that even if the mandate expires on October 8th, Hamilton County Schools will have staff and students wear masks as long as they remain in phase three. We also asked you today to weigh in. Do you agree with a 30 day extension of the mandate? Nearly 68% said yes, just over 32% said no to vote in today's poll. You can find that on the News Channel 9 Twitter page.